Hello and welcome to the Price Academy Bite Size History Videos. This video is introducing the discovery of Lucy. On November 24, 1974, American paleoanthropologist Donald Johansson and his graduate student Tom Gray discovered remains of an early human that they called Lucy. The pair were with other scientists at Hadar in the Rift Valley in Ethiopia, an area believed to have been where the very earliest human beings first evolved and likely to contain the very earliest human fossils. On their return to their Land Rover after a long morning dig, they saw sticking up from the surface of the sand a fragment bone, which was an extremely old forearm bone. Continuing the search, they found a skull, pelvis, some ribs, a femur and a jawbone, all identified as comprising the skeleton of a hominid. A couple of weeks later, after many hours of patient excavation, 40% of a single skeleton were found. This creature also walked upright. It was bipedal, less like a modern chimpanzee and more like a human. The age of the bones were approximately 3.2 million years and Lucy was thought to be an adult but aged around 11 to 12. Her skull showed her back wisdom tooth was fully developed. But why is she called Lucy? During the celebrations of the first night of discovery, the scientists were listening to a Beatles song called Lucy in the Sky of Diamonds, and so it was that the skeleton identified correctly as female on the basis of a pelvic bone got the name Lucy, and it has stuck ever since. More than 300 complete skeletons like Lucy have been found, and have been given the name Australopithecus afarensis, meaning southern ape from afar, the area in Ethiopia Lucy was found. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and follow me at Little Miss History 81 at Tanya Alex 38.